Long week of snow plowing for our NDOT and Public Works crews, and we found some of the roads, they're still very much like this, covered in snow. Fox 59's Mike Sullivan checked out a few parts of town today and found neighborhoods still waiting for some relief on the roads. For NDOT and DPW crews, their work is done, but the extra contractors brought on by the city will still be working on side roads that at times can look like this. COVID time could be a blur. It's hard to remember yesterday let alone 2018, our last major snowfall. It's been even longer. The last time that um, we had to call out contractors was in more than six or seven years ago. Since plow crews endured the type of endless work they have this week. Our NDDPW crews have been on uh, in 12 hour shifts since last Sunday night. Ben Easley is with NDDPW. Several of our contractors helped out with the connectors. Those happen Tuesday and Wednesday night. As of 3 p.m. this afternoon, the residential streets of four contracted townships are complete with five more in the works. We expect them to be done either this evening or tomorrow morning. I really think that they are truly like you know, the rock stars in all of this. For NDOT, that's more than 320 drivers. That equates to about 12,000 man hours even more when it comes to salt usage. Across central Indiana, um, we used more than 7,000 tons of salt. At one point, we were at 30% capacity, and that's, that's internal to DPW. Both agencies will be getting more salt over the next few days. We regularly get deliveries. Even during irregular times. Next week, NDOT is planning on shifting their crews to pothole control. With some of these increasing temperatures getting a little warmer next week, they say that is the recipe for potholes. So far, between this year and last year, pothole numbers have been down. In Fountain Square, I'm Mike Sullivan, Fox 59 News.